Well, thank you for tuning in to another edition of Love Library at Home. I'm Alexis Lawrence, your adult librarian, and today our do-it-yourself project is going to be making t-shirt tote bags. And I think this is a great summer project that to make. Um, it's great for carrying out on the beach and things like that if you're gonna get out and about walking. And um, if you were doing a lot of spring cleaning or um, searching through and getting rid of things while you're stuck at home during this time, for me, I found a lot of old t-shirts and things like that that I love, but I'm not gonna wear anymore and I don't quite wanna get rid of, but I wanted to repurpose and use. Um, and one of those things is I participated in a color run and I love the colors on it and things like that. And I wanted to do something with it. So we're going to go ahead and make that uh, t-shirt bag. And so one of the things that you can do is to fold the t-shirt in half and you're gonna make sure that that is lined up. And if you have fabric scissors, you're going to go ahead and cut the sleeves off once it's measured and lined up. I do not have good fabric scissors, so I'm going to cut my sleeves off individually. Right, so that's one sleeve. Now the other. Okay. And then the next thing you want to do is go ahead and cut a U shape into the collar of your t shirt. I'm going to stand up for this. So no, you can't see me, but. And that we'll go ahead and make our handle so far for our bags. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're going to cut strips along the bottom and we're gonna cut them halfway up, or um, an inch up, so to speak. Um, for me, I'm gonna measure, there's a happy 5K, so I'm gonna go up about that high. So now that we've cut the bottom of our shirt, we're going to take the ends and tie them in knots. And the last one. All right, so now that we have them, you'll notice that there are gaps or spaces in between yours. So what we're going to do, spread them out, is you're going to take the top knot of yours and the bottom knot of the second one and you're going to tie those together in a knot. And you're going to just repeat that process going through, taking the top knot and the bottom of the other one. To kind of tie up the bottom part of the bag.
And then now that that's done, you're going to actually double tie the ends so that it stays in place. And then you're going to do the same thing on the other side. Secure the ends. Then we actually take our bag, turn it inside out. And now we have a bag to use for the summer. And you can actually store things in there. And it's cinched well. Uh, you can see that or not. So it will hold and not drop anything. I've actually tested mine out before with like bottles, just to see how much it will hold while I'm out and about carrying things for the summer. So you have a nice cool bag for the summer. I've also tried it out with a smaller bag. So I have a, another um, bag that I made out of a Zumba shirt as well. Um, this one was already kind of um, designed and um, with other prints and things like that, but this bag was, is now shortened so that I can actually put other things in it and travel and take it with me. So thank you for tuning in for this do-it-yourself craft project to make your own summer bag to use for the summertime. And we hope to see you next time and check us out on our other do-it-yourself videos.